what's up everyone welcome to another episode of paranormal torch and graveyard haunts and today we are in ringland st peter's i think it's called this church so what we'll do is have a little wander around see how big the church is i don't think we can go in because of covid restrictions but hopefully maybe get a dictaphone out see if there's anything going on here So tonight I'm here with um, the guys from the uh, paranormal team I'm in, past paranormal. We've got another Jamie here, and she's there. And she's, right. <laughs> and, uh, she's actually got her SLS. So we'll walk around the graveyard, see if it picks anything up, do a little bit of a sweep. Weird why this is blank over it, and I think big massive gap of graves. Yeah, well, I don't think they could use the graves were as they were. Um, it can't be. It was on that uh, that haunted program where there was, there was a church that they turned into a community centre. Okay. And uh, they basically just put all the gravestones on the edge. All oh, right. And you think, well, actually, that makes a bit of sense. Isn't it? Quite, um, yeah, it's calm. Yeah. It's very calm. You can see my... Uh, yeah, in... no, I, I just saw it and I thought it was quite good to... Uh... The infrared. <laughs> so these graves, I think they're around the wrong side, actually. <laughs> Jeremiah Valentine Abel. Nice. That's interesting. See that on there, the cross. Actually, it's more like a gated symbol with a snake for it. Is that wings of an angel or something? William Moore. Here. Have you? My name's Jamie. Gary. And I'm another Jamie. <laughs> nice to meet you. We've just come to say hi. You can see there's a map in there, see? So whereabouts is that? That's on the... Oh, near the stone. Here. Is this your... Oh, hang on. Is your phone on? Someone's phone on? Yeah, my phone's on, yeah. Are you live? Yeah. Oh, happy way. <laughs> is this your gravestone? Still there? Yeah. I'm just going to put this near you. Can you touch this? Could you reach out to the light? It won't do you any harm. Can you wave like you did? Can you wave like this, sir? It won't do you any harm. Is it kneeling down? Yeah. I remember your family's grave? Yeah, he's praying. That's mm. what I wondered if he's praying. Are you... Are we interrupting you? It's got your hands together, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> Let's put the... Uh, Shall we leave you to be? I'm just going to put a record on. Okay. If you want to follow us at any point and say hello. Right, hang on. I've put the record on, so if we just do some asking now. Can you tell me your name? Or maybe the name of the person whose grave that is? Would you be able to stand up for us? You look like you're kneeling down, sir. Or lady. Stand up for us. You look like you're kneeling down, sir. Or lady. There you are. Would 
would you mind trying to stand up for us? Come on. Do they need a helping hand? <laughs> you wait for us? Do you want to use my arm? Help a gentleman up, or a lady. It's <laughs> unusual, isn't it? Yeah. Do you have a message before we move on to another grave sign? Should we leave you be and let you carry on praying? Okay. We'll leave you be, thank you. Thank you, sir. Or madam. <laughs> Interesting to know who they've gone. Oh. Very interesting. That was, wasn't it? Especially how it left. Yeah. It's like you're going, so I'm going. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Anyway. That just went behind me. Yeah. Did, oh, who are you mapping there? Oh, You're mapping someone else. Yeah, but it's just like every time. I'm... Are you there, sir? Can or you madam? Us again? We just saw you. There yeah. You Which is? That one. Uh, it should be the one on the left. Yeah. Are you back again? Is that a different one or is that the same one? No, it's a different one. Um, we've got another one, um, Gary. This one's standing up. Could you just wave to us and say hello? Hi, sir. Hi, madam. That's a very strange. That is unusual, isn't it? Mm. Could you just stand up properly for us again? So we can see how tall you are. Would you be able to do that for us? Stand up right. Were there plague pits here? Or cholera pits? Where lots of people were buried. Yep. Oh wow. Interesting. I'm not so back. I'm not back. Yeah. Can you touch me? Can you touch Gary on his head? So this screen here is actually mirrored, is that right? Yeah, so it'll yeah. so it's that it's, it's the other way around. It's that side to him. Yeah, oh it's gone. It's gone though. Sorry, I didn't mean to No? no. It's a squiggle. It's behind him. It's obviously picking something strange up, isn't it? No, it's gone. No, it's... It's actually ongoing. Hmm. And it's gone. Yeah, that was interesting to have um, two SLS captured. Yeah. These always fascinate me, these little graves here. No, the little the little triangle ones. On the ground. <laughs> You're getting loads of bugs on you. Yep. It's all gone quiet now, isn't it? Mm -hmm. For oh, finally, someone's talking to me. <laughs> Interesting to hear people get back. Yeah, I'll have to check. Mm. But that's what it is um, with these. I think <clears throat> when we're in these 
these situations, when we're in these situations, for the first time in a long time for them, someone's talking to them. Yeah. And I do think they get uh, excited with that. I, I think they do. I think they. Uh, I think that trying to come with the best sort of intention, isn't it? Because I always think, well, is it disrespectful in the church? Maybe, I don't know. But I also think there's an element of, mm. you know, I don't mm. think they're here. I actually think, you know, like that person there, that's probably them praying. Yeah. Something they do all the time, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Um, what do you reckon, everyone? Is it someone praying? Have we disturbed someone? Do they get excitable if people like us come in and start talking to them? Near this stone, the remains of who died at Hingham Hall in this county, 1808. Wow. Wow, indeed. They've got tombs down here, isn't it? Underneath the... Funny if I opened. Yeah, look. Actually, within. See him? Herring and. William Herring. 1789. Yeah. Oh, they're getting older. Yeah. Is that another herring? That must be a family around here then. I bet so. Can't see the. Yeah, it's a John Herring. Yeah. John Goss Herring. Is it the date? Uh, November. Here we go, 28 years old. Uh, died, something, by all his relatives. Oh. <laughs> Well, anyway, that's it for this little episode of Graveyard Haunts. Um, if you like this, make sure you hit the like video and also subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next one. So thank you and take care. Cheers, guys.